Hey, what's going on guys? So in this video, I'm going to show you a really simple way on how to create a coming soon page for your website without using any plugins, without installing any plugins, because uh, using a plugin for a simple functionality like this is too much weight on your website and your website is slowing down. It's using too many resources and too many uh, queries to the database, uh, useless stuff, you know. Um, so in this video, I'm going to show you a way on how to create a coming soon page for your uh, users and at the same time having the um, having this page on the front end website you can use you can work on the back end website so uh, here's what i have i have uh, a storefront child storefront theme installed and i'm uh, i just uh, activated a storefront child theme for my website this is how it looks like now um so uh this is uh my uh, i opened my vs code in my storefront child theme folder and what i have here is functions.php file and the style.css file these two files are the most important so i'm going to open my p uh, functions.php file and i'm going to type in here a function and, and i'm going to add an action so the function is the following we have function let's say vicode you need a prefix just in just to make sure this function name is not being used by any other uh, plugins on your website so we have vicode uh, maintenance and then here we have an if statement which is gonna check if it's different than uh, is user is user underscore logged underscore in so which means if the user is logged out, if the, if the user is not logged in, um, we will create another folder here in our storefront folder. And this folder is actually going to be the coming soon. And here we will create a new file, which is going to be index.php, right like this. And here we will require, we will call this uh, index.php file. So we will have require once and we have here coming soon slash index.php like this index.php and then we have die function which is gonna prevent the execution of any other codes below this function and then here we just add an action and the first parameter is the action type so this is gonna be get header and then the second parameter is the function name the the functionality we call in this get header hook all right we press like this we save it now in our inks.php i'm gonna put an h1 tag uh, you can actually make it an html let's do it an html5 page in the title coming soon and in the body section we have an h1 tag that's gonna say it's gonna say uh coming soon uh, let's save it uh, now let's go back to our website I'm gonna refresh the page nothing happens because I'm logged in but if I open a uh, an incognito tab and if I refresh the page we can see the coming soon here so uh, which means that if I'm not logged in on my website I'm gonna see this coming soon page if I'm logged in I won't see it so that's it guys I hope you like this video um, if you liked it, please give it give it a thumbs up subscribe for my channel If you have any questions leave them in the comments I don't have any repository for this code because it's really a small snippet here. You can just pause the video and copy it um, Yep, thank you very much for your attention and I'll see you in the next videos